Hey friends, welcome back to Kimmy's Kitchen and More. I hope you guys are having a great day. Happy Mask Monday. I'm pulling my hair back because I have on this Freeman Brightening Cucumber Peel Off Face Mask. And I love the way it feels and I love the way it smells. But if you get just one little strand, oh, it will make a sticky, sticky, sticky mess. Um, I really need to put a, a scrunchie in there. But anyways, anyways, I'll just try to keep it back. I was going to put on this brightening, the Chalk Chalk Brightening Gemstone Mini Mask. Um, so... What you do is you put it, there's one for your forehead, two for like under your eye area, and then one for your, um, between your eyes. So maybe I'll do that next time. That is like a 20 to 30 minute one. Of course this one I think is only like, fifth, yeah, 10 to 15, so this is nice. So I promised you guys another tour of my um, jewelry box. I'm going to give that to you guys right after this. I'm going to show you guys um, a small Dollar Tree haul. So, um, first off, I have this Reach Essentials Instant Whitening Pen. And I've used these before and I really like them. And this does not expire until January of 2023. And it says Ultra Fine Bristles Easy Reach Design and extra soft applicator brush. Um, basically, you just brush your teeth, take the pen, you twist it, put it on, and then you leave it on for a while and all that. So anyways, I got that. I have bought that before. I do like those. I went there to pick up some, I'm still, I was still looking for that ice cream for my daughter, um, the strawberry. I did find it, the ice, the pop, the popsicles, um, that has like the little like candy coatings or whatever on the outside of them. I did finally find them in another store in another town when I had to go to another town. Um, but anyways, I got I got a couple boxes of those so that she'll have some to last her for a little bit. They, you only get three in a box, so it's not like it really lasts you a long time. But anyways, so I got three of those. I got this. And then I got her three of these charcoal cleansing nose strips. Um, you get two nose strips. And um, she really likes those. She said that they work good. So I got her three boxes of those. So she's got six of those. Um, and she just loves that stuff. And then I found this really pretty Kiss Gel Shine nail polish. And I thought that was really, really pretty. Um, and then I also got some of this LA's Totally Awesome Oxygen Orange Formula um, All Purpose Spot Remover. So I'm excited to give this a try. Um, I can tell you it doesn't have, maybe once you put it in a wash and you mix it in with the water and um, maybe it will, I don't know. You guys can comment down below and let me know if you've used it and what you think. But on first opening, first off, y'all know how I am about seals. I didn't look at it in the store. I need to start looking at stuff in the store because I'm there and I don't think of it. But it did not have a seal on it. That's what it looks like. Comes with one of those little scoops. Has a very strong sell, smell of bleach. Um, I was really hoping to have more of an orange scent, but it doesn't. So we'll see. If you guys have used that before, please comment down below and let me know what you guys think of it. Then I was super, super excited. I was in the beauty aisle and I was looking at, you know, like stuff like this and the nose strips for my daughter and stuff like that. And I was looking at their different makeup. They, a lot of the stuff was very, um, very messed up, like kind of all over the place. And, um, how they have it up on their racks. They have quite a nice large section area for their makeup, but um, it was very picked over, not much left. Of course, this was on a Sunday afternoon, Sunday evening, so that could be why, I don't know. Probably is why. But anyways, I found this in a basket. There was a whole bunch of them. I cannot tell you why I did not get more, and something even told me to get a couple, and I just, like, I didn't. Um, but I noticed that it said avocado, olive, and basil, and so it's a, it's a hand therapy lotion. And I thought, oh, I'm going to pick one of those up, you know, put it in my car or whatever. Oh, my goodness. These are great for your car, your pocketbook, wherever. I am so disappointed because it wasn't until I got home and I was showing my daughter and we were talking about it. And I looked and I went, 
I couldn't believe it. It's Crabtree and Evelyn. I was like, are you kidding me? Crabtree and Evelyn at the Dollar Tree? Y'all, just for this one little, this is like a um, point, point 0.9 ounce on Amazon. And it's just on Amazon. I didn't look like on the Crabtree and Evelyn website or anything like that. Or I just went to Amazon just out of curiosity. It's $8.99. $8.99, guys, for one little point 0.9 ounce of this. So um, I do have to go back that way later in the week. So I am going to check because I was like, oh my gosh, we had gotten my mother-in-law for her birthday. We had got her, she loves Crabtree and Evelyn, and we had gotten her the rose and a couple different like things like body wash, lotions, and things like that. But um, this is the avocado. I could not believe it. Actually, I haven't, um, oh, and guess what? I did look. It is sealed. Go figure, right? So I want to smell it. But um, I am definitely going to check because... Oh my goodness, you oh, <laughs> squirted that right on my nose, I'm so silly. But um, I'm gonna check because, oh my gosh, they make such wonderful gifts for birthday, Christmas, whatever. I know Mother's Day has passed, but things like that. I mean, because like I said, you can you can put them in a little gift bag or set up a little, you know, gift set of it. Oh my goodness, I couldn't believe it. Put like, put like a couple of these in there with some like, some of the, um, bath soaps or, or bath salts, uh, maybe some uh, lip gloss or uh, chapstick, anything like that that the person might like, and a little book or something. It would make such a nice gift basket for, like I said, birthdays, you know, grandparents' day, anything, you know, like that, Christmas, whatever. Um, so I was super excited, but I was very disappointed that I only got one. But So I'm going to go back there and check and see if they have some more. But it sure does make your hands smell and feel so nice and smooth and oh my gosh it would be amazing if i found the rose um but the avocado is nice too and i just like i said i cannot believe crabtree and evelyn at the dollar tree what okay look i'm gonna stop this video here because we're now into seven minutes and y'all don't want to hear me ramble anymore you want to see that door box so i'm gonna take you over there and show you so stay with me okay friends so this is part two of the jewelry box um, tour and I will do part three of the drawers. They'll take a while um, the next time on Mask Monday, but for now, so let's see. First off, we have this beautiful necklace that was gifted to me by Lois over at Life with Lois's. And this beautiful one, that was gifted to me from my friend Ellen over at, um, actually Ellen doesn't have a channel. I wish she did, but that's, it's like a mermaid look to it. And that is from Sweet Sweet Ellen. And um, this one here I had bought years ago and it has the matching earrings um, from um, Avon actually. Oh, what that is? I don't know. Um, <clears throat> And then this beautiful one here with the K on it, my son had gifted me. And I think I've, I've told y'all before, he gets me jewelry for like my birthday and Mother's Day and special holidays like that, Christmas. Um, I know birthday's not a holiday, but you guys know what I mean. <laughs> Mother's Day and Christmas and things like that. Um, and then this one was gifted to me from my mother-in-law and it has the matching earrings as well. It's kind of like a, a topaz stone. It's much prettier in person, but it's harder to see now. And then this one is my birthstone. Um, it looks very dark, but it is sapphire. I've had that for a very long time. And this one, um, I got from like a one of those party um, jewelry parties a long time ago. It says hope on it and has a little flower. And then my son gifted me this when he was very, very young. See, he started gifting me jewelry when he was very young. And this is a, for, for those of you who don't know, this is a Minecraft uh, pendant. So for him to gift that to me was pretty special because he always loved Minecraft growing up. So um, this is very, very special to me. And another one that is very, very, very special is this one. Um, 
my daughter made this picture when she was very, very young in school, in elementary school, uh, maybe kindergarten, first grade, and the school turned it into art. They had a um, person that was contracted through them, and they would turn, um, or they turned it into jewelry. They turned art into jewelry. So that's very, very special. That's her holding a little balloon. <laughs> Uh, and they also turned them into magnets also. And then this uh, beautiful necklace was gifted to me from Sweet Rosemary over at Rosemary's You Rock Art. And that was really pretty. And let's see, this butterfly one. I'm trying to think. This butterfly and this dolphin, because I used to collect dolphins. I always loved dolphins. Um, I'm trying to think. I don't remember if I bought that in the set or not, but, and then this ladybug one, my mom gifted me many years ago from Avon, and I want to say this one as well, it's like a three-piece set, it's really cute, it's a bracelet, these are anklets, these are bracelets, and then this one was like in a little set, I want to say maybe I got it from Amazon, same with these. These are all, these here are all anklets. And that's really pretty. And then, same with this one. This was like an Amazon little set. Just, just a little cheapy. <laughs> okay, let's see. Over here. So, so, as you can see, I've got like the gold on that side. And then the silver on this one. So, I was gifted this one many years ago. Honestly, it's terrible, but I don't remember. It was a really pretty piece. Diamonds. And then my husband gifted me this one, um, Mother's Day. It says Dominic and Bella on it. And my son gifted me this beautiful one a few years ago for Christmas. And then um, my friend Lois over at Life with Lois's, she gifted me this one. And it's a paparazzi piece and it has earrings with it. And my husband gifted me this, and it has the matching earrings. Guys, seen at my top of my jewelry box, it has the matching earrings and uh, ring. It's a three-piece set. He got me that several years ago for my birthday, and then he got me this one a few years ago for Mother's Day. The kids picked it out. It says Mama Bear because <laughs> I'm a Mama Bear for sure. And then this one, my son gifted me this one. Um, I want to say this is my, my birthday. This one was really, really pretty. I love that one. And then Lois also gifted me this one. Either the gold one or the silver one like this. Um, I won in the giveaway. But either way, Lois gifted me them as well. And um, as, well, uh, as well as this one. This little pretty, um, like a dove with a little green stone at the bottom as a paparazzi piece and um, I want to say Lois gifted me this as well yeah let me know down below if I'm wrong Lois but I'm pretty sure you gifted me that one as well yes yes because it's paparazzi piece and it has earrings with it as well as well as this one she gifted me this one Very beautiful and then my mom had got me this years ago from Avon, and it has the earrings to match it as well. Um, and again, this one she also got me from Avon many years ago, and it has the matching earrings. This one I had got myself um, in Disney World. Disney World or Disneyland. I think it was Disney World in Florida. Because we've been to Disney lean in California many many years ago but I'm pretty sure this was Disney World and then this is fading but this was our husband my husband and I we did pictures in Texas many many years ago when he was stationed there and you could get your photo onto a dog tag or any kind of I really need to have it cleaned I would love to see it kind of buff back to its natural but but yeah, guys, so that's my drawer box tour for this week. I hope you all enjoyed, and I hope you enjoyed this Mask Monday. And please join me next uh, week for the drawer tour. All right, for the next Mask Monday. Um, have a blessed day. Stay safe, be kind, and until next time, bye, y'all.